Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 36 to the power of 5 minus 36, uh, we write this algebraic expression into the simplified form without using the calculator. So uh, here calculator is not allowed, it means that we will show all of the working on this paper. Uh, and now here I can uh, give you some nice tricks in which you can do all of the calculations or all of the multiplications uh, in your mind so you don't need uh, any calculator or any calculation on this page so uh, I hope so you like this video uh, if you have any other method uh, to do this type of questions please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so the very first step we are going to do is here uh, first uh, we rewrite this uh, expression as uh, here we break the uh, exponent of this term so its exponent is 5 we write it as 4 plus 1 plus this is over 36 and now here in the next step we need to apply the exponent law you know that if you have a to the power of m plus n equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so according to this uh, exponent law we can break the exponent of this term and it will be written as 36 to the power of 4 multiplied by 36 to the power of 1 plus this is 36 uh, and now here you see that uh, 36 be the common term so we will take common 36 and we get the remaining terms are here you get 36 to the power of 4 and plus here we will take common 36 and we get the remaining term is equals to 1 and now here in the next step uh, we need to rewrite these terms as this is 36 times of this is 36 to the power of 4 uh, so we uh, write it as 36 to the power of 2 multiplied by 2 and plus this is over 1 uh, and now here uh, we need to uh, apply another exponent law uh, you know that if we have uh, a to the power of m multiplied by n it is equals to a to the power of m to the power of n so uh, after this step uh, when you can apply this exponent law on here so it will be written as 36 multiplied by uh, here we have 36 square and its whole square plus this is our one uh, and now further in the next step we need a more simplification so that here our first target is to find the value of 36 here so you see that this is the square of a bigger number uh, and you see that uh, I can just do uh, this uh, multiplication in our mind. So first we need to find the square of 36. Uh, so 36 square means that we will multiply 36 with 36. Uh, so in order to multiply these two values we will break this term and it will be written as 36 times of 30 plus 6 okay and uh, now here uh, we will multiply this 36 on both of these values so it will be written as uh, 36 multiplied by 30 plus 36 multiplied by 6 so after this step uh, here we need to multiply these two terms and uh, now you consider this is our one digit number this is our two digits numbers so when you multiply this zero with this number so you will get here zero and when we multiply this three with this number you get here three six is 18 we write eight and carry one this is three times of three is nine nine plus one becomes ten it means that 36 times of 30 equals to 1080 and now here in the next step we will multiply 6 times of 36 and it will be written as 6 6 is 36 we will write 6 and carry 1 6 3 is 18 18 plus 1 becomes 19 and now here we need to sum up these two values so you have 0 plus 6 becomes 6 8 plus 9 equals to 17 we write 7 and carry 1 where 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 1 is 2 and this is our 1 it means that uh, 36 square equals to 1276 
and now we move backward and you see here we have 36 square and its whole square so it means that we need to take the square again on both of the sides so it will be written as 36 square and its whole square equals to 1276 whole square so in the next step we need to find the square of this term so uh, here we rewrite this term as 1276 multiplied by 1276 so we break this value as 1276 into we rewrite this as 1000 plus 200 plus 70 plus 6 uh, so here further we multiply this complete number with all of these values so when you multiply this number with this you will get here 1 2 7 6 and triple 0 and when we multiply this number with this we write it as 1 2 7 6 multiplied by 200 now we multiply this by this number you get 1 2 7 6 multiplied by 70 uh, and plus we multiply 1 2 7 6 by this 6 okay uh, so here further we need to multiply these values and at the last we add all of these values you get here 1 2 7 6 and triple 0 plus here you consider this is one digit number this is three digits number uh, so when you multiply this zero with this complete number we will get zero when you multiply this zero with this number you get zero and now we multiply two times of this number 2 6 at 1 we write 2 and carry 1 2 7s are 14 14 plus 1 is 15 we write 5 and carry 1 2 2s are 4 4 plus 1 is 5 2 1s are 2 plus we multiply uh, this complete number with these two numbers so you see here 0 time of this number becomes 0 and 7 6 are 42 we write 2 and carry 4 7 7s are 49 49 plus uh, 4 becomes 53 we write 3 and carry 5 7 to the 14 14 uh, plus 5 becomes 19 we write 9 and carry 1 7 1 the 7 7 plus 1 is 8 and plus here you have uh, we need to multiply these two numbers so this is 6 times of 6 becomes 36 we write 6 and carry 3 6 7 the 42 42 plus 3 45 we write 5 and carry 4 6 to the 12 12 plus 4 become 16 we write 6 and carry 1 6 1 the 6 6 plus 1 becomes here 7 and now here in the next step we need to add all of these values so here we add these values directly and you see here we have uh, first you add 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 6 equals to 6 and then 0 plus 0 plus 2 becomes here 2 2 plus 5 is 7 we write 7 here so this is 6 plus 2 is 8 8 plus 3 is 11 11 plus 6 becomes 17 uh, and so we write 7 and carry 1 and after that we have 7 plus 5 becomes 12 12 plus 9 becomes 21 21 plus 7 becomes 28 28 plus 1 becomes here 29 we write 9 and carry 2 so we have this is 2 plus 5 is 7 7 plus 8 becomes 15 now 15 plus 2 becomes 17 we write 7 and carry 1 so we have 1 plus 2 is 3 3 plus 1 becomes here 4 and now further you see here this will be uh, the square of 36 square and its whole square now our above expression is written as so we have 36 to the power of 5 minus 36 equals to 36 multiplied by this is 36 square so we put the value of 36 square it is uh, 4 uh, it will become here 4, 7, 9, and double 7, 6 and plus 1. We can write this equation to the above, okay. So here we copy down this one here and you get uh, 36 times of when you add these values. It will be written as 4, 7, 9, double 7 and triple 7, okay. So here we need to multiply this 36 with this number. So here uh, we need to break this 36. We write it as 4, 7, 9, triple seven multiplied by we write 36 as 30 plus 6 so we multiply these two values here so first we multiply uh, this complete number with these two digits so you get here zero time of this complete number equals to zero and three times of seven becomes 
So three sevens are twenty one. We write one and carry two. Three sevens are twenty one. Twenty one plus two twenty three. We write three and carry two. Three sevens are twenty one. Twenty one plus two twenty three. We write three and carry two. The three nines are twenty seven. Twenty seven plus two twenty nine. We write nine and carry two. Three sevens are twenty one. Twenty one plus two becomes twenty three. We write three and carry two. Three fours are twelve. Twelve plus two becomes fourteen. Similarly, we will multiply this six with all of these values, and it will be written as the six sevens are forty two. Uh, so we write here two and carry four. Six sevens are forty two. Forty two plus four becomes forty six. We write six and carry four. Six sevens are forty two. Forty two plus four forty six. We write six and carry four. The six nines are fifty four. Fifty four plus four fifty eight. We write eight and carry five. Six sevens are forty two. Forty two plus five become forty seven. We write seven and carry four. Six fours are twenty four. Twenty four plus four becomes here twenty eight. And now here in the last step we uh, sum up these two values. So here we add zero plus two becomes two. One plus six is seven. Three plus six is nine. This three plus eight becomes eleven. We write one and carry one. Nine plus seven becomes sixteen. Sixteen plus one is seventeen. We write seven and carry one. Three plus eight is eleven. Eleven plus one twelve. We write two and carry one. Four plus two six six plus one is seven and this is our one. So this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.